So, Coach, uh, talk to me about the four-game one streak. Have you seen anything different in your team? Yeah, they're older. <laughs> you know, I think that uh, as you go through the season, you kind of hope that you improve as the season goes along. And with a young team, uh, it's critical because uh, you don't know how they're going to react to adversity during the season. And I think this is an indicator that uh, they're accepting it and they are doing something about it. So you talk about them getting a year older. Do you feel like this, uh, this season will help down the road for these next two years since you have such a young team? Oh, yeah, I don't think there's any doubt about that. I think that, uh, you know, past experience here with the teams that we've had and have had success have, have gone through this to some extent. I think this year is no different. Uh, we probably have fewer experienced players on this team to help give guidance in that direction, but, uh, uh, but they're, they're picking it up pretty well. Can you talk about the two road wins last weekend at Brandeis and NYU? Those were really good games. Your team fought hard, especially on Sunday at NYU. Yeah, I, I think that, uh, you know, uh, over the past three weeks, these guys have really been focusing in on what they want to try to accomplish and, and finishing out the season on a strong note. And, uh, you know, we lost at Emory in a, in a close game and then be able to come home and win two games and then go on the road and win two games, I think that uh, is a good indicator of what they're trying to accomplish. So a couple a couple more questions, Coach. Luke Silverman Loy will play his final game Saturday at Chicago. Can you talk about just how he's grown as a player here at WashU? Well, Luke's freshman year, he was injured and didn't even get to play. And, and uh, you know, he kept himself involved in the program. So his sophomore year, his first year of actually uh, being active, he stepped in and he was playing, uh, he was playing with a pretty good team. And I think they helped uh, give him some, some uh, uh, direction and understanding what he was going to have to do to be able to compete at this level. But the thing that is uh, the most unique about Luke, or I wouldn't say unique, but is great about Luke, is that uh, he's a very good leader. Uh, you know, that uh, whether we win or lose, or whether he has a good game or a bad game, he's provided solid leadership all year long. And uh, this is extremely important when you're working with a young team. And, you know, I, don't, I, I hope the players on the team recognize how, how important his role has been, both on the court and off the court, uh, in the development of the program. Coach, uh, season finale at Chicago this weekend, lost by one here at home. How, how important is it to go up there and play a good game and keep the momentum going into next season? I think, uh, I think that it's big for us with respect to what our goals are, uh, what we want to try to accomplish through uh, to the end of this season. And, uh, you know, it's just like anything else. We're going to give it everything we got. Uh, we like our chances, our players are going up there to win and, and that's what we're after.